To get this super easy Harry Potter look, you will need a base coat, black polish, a white striper, dark green polish, red, dark blue, yellow, silver, and bronzy gold, and a top coat. Start out by painting your index finger with the dark green polish, then paint your middle finger red. Your ring blue, your pinky yellow, and your thumb black. Here I'm taking a white striper dipped into silver polish to draw diagonal lines across my index finger. I'm also using the silver polish on my ring finger, and what I'm doing is I'm drawing about four to five lines on each nail. You want a good deal of space between the first and second line, and then the second and third line to be close together, the third and fourth to be far apart, and the fourth and fifth to be close together. On my Gryffindor and Hufflepuff nail, I'm doing the same thing, only on Gryffindor I'm using that bronzy gold color, and on Hufflepuff I'm using a black. To achieve this Deathly Hallows symbol, we're going to start off by putting a triangle with three dots on the thumbnail. Now we're just going to connect the dots to form our solid triangle, and don't worry if the lines don't come out perfect, you can go back over it later. As you'll see between these takes, the first one it looks a little it doesn't look opaque, and then I go back and I make sure it's more opaque at the second take. Now after I've gone back over that triangle, I'm drawing a circle, and the key is to have the circle touch all sides of the triangle. You don't want any space between the lines. Now what we're going to do is just going to draw a line from the middle of the triangle up to the point to form our Deathly Hallows. Now we're putting on a top coat. And this just gives a beautiful shine and helps protect our manicure for a little longer. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked it and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.